If you have meeting rooms and or are utilizing video conferencing in your organization, we have a software solution that can help you work smarter and more efficiently. Now let's demonstrate what we solve and how we can help you. I will now demonstrate how to schedule a meeting with two meeting rooms and how we enable the one button to push in multiple scenarios. I will also show you additional features such as automatic check-in, no-show detection, end of conference alerts, and automatic room release. Finally, we will look at how our analytics tool can help you improve every step of your meeting cycle. We support multiple meeting platforms, including on-prem, cloud, and hybrid environments. All meetings can be scheduled in your preferred calendar client, and no plugins are needed. In this example, I'm scheduling a Microsoft Teams meeting with two meeting rooms. For Cisco WebEx meetings, you simply have to add the at WebEx to the location field, and we will automatically deliver the one button to push experience. The meeting is scheduled, and this room is empty, but this room will be used by my two colleagues. We offer two different solutions for automatic check-in. Either you can use the built-in sensors in the Cisco WebEx devices, or you can use one of the Synergy Sky IoT sensors. Here, my two colleagues are automatically checked in by the sensors in the Cisco WebEx device. They can now decide whether they would like to join the meeting with a push of a button or to join by using the Cisco WebEx Assistant. When the meeting is connected, it will automatically appear in the control panel. Here, you can plan, monitor, and control the meeting and see details such as people count. Now, what happens to the other booked meeting room that was left empty? When there is no presence detected by the sensor in the room after a given time, the room will show up as empty. The meeting organizer will then receive an email requesting action to keep the meeting room. If the organizer leaves this unattended, the room will automatically be released and made available for others to book. Equally important as starting the meeting on time is to end it on time. We offer end of meeting alerts in order to give the participants time to wrap up in time for the next meeting to avoid scenarios like this. Let's take a look at how we can help you optimizing your meeting resource utilization. This dashboard gives an overview of your organization's meeting behavior. I have selected a period of the last 14 days and I can see the number of meetings conducted over this period. I can also see how many meetings that have been booked in rooms with sensors, how many no-shows there have been, and how much waste that we can potentially reduce. The seat utilization shows you the people count compared to the seat capacity of the meeting rooms. And if we go up in the right-hand corner, we can see meetings that have been organized by internal versus external organizer. The meeting types show you the meeting platforms that these meetings have been conducted on. And this also gives you an indication of what kind of meeting platforms that the users prefer to book meetings on. I hope you found this interesting. Thanks for watching.